Hi guys, it's Cool and welcome back to my channel. So, it's July and obviously it's ice cream month. So here we are, gonna try out Mary Moo's ice cream and I have a special guest today with me. Yay! It's good. It's Ia. So yeah, so we're gonna be trying all the Mary Moo flavors except for candied bacon and Earl Grey because they didn't have that in stock. But we have everything else. So here's the first batch of Mary Moo ice cream. Yeah, can you tell us what we're gonna grade the ice cream on? First off is the taste. And lastly is would you eat it again? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So yeah. Okay, let's get into the taste testing. Let's start with black sesame Oreo. Focused. Wow. Whoa. I didn't even see it yet. First bite. <laughs> Look at her faces. Five. <laughs> oh, see, it's just salted. It's, it's, it's like not super salty, but 
It just has a, such a strong taste. I'd give it a 6 then. It's very, very caramel -y. Mm. Like it's so overwhelming <laughs> that my one bite is like, I'm good. My second bite was, I'm very good. <laughs> <laughs> but if you like salted caramel and don't mind the overwhelming taste, go ahead. Yeah! Would you eat it again, yes or no? Yes or no, no. <laughs> I'm having a love hate relationship with it. No. <laughs> um, I guess not. Like, if I were asked to pick ice cream, I wouldn't pick that. Mm -mm. Okay, I'd eat it again. Yeah. But yeah. with vanilla. <laughs> Yan lang, yeah. Okay, next. Did I pick that one? Did I pick that one? Cookies and. Wow, it looks so clear. It's so nice, no? iPhone, talaga. Ooh. It's a pretty plain as to what I was expecting. Okay, cookies and brownies flavor. This is what it looks like on the spoon. Cheers, bago matuno. I like it. Me too, I like it. I like it. <laughs> yeah, the, the case is settled, you like it. <laughs> okay, there's like little. Oh, it tastes good. There's like little brownie bits, I think. There's, can you see? I wish you can see. Okay, there's like a little slime thingy that's like brownie. There's like little bits of the cookies in the brownie. Focus! There we go. See? You see that brown thing? It's so good. I like it. Um, I'd pick this flavor. I'd give it a 10. Mm. 10. Wait, no. 9.9. .9. I'd like it I'm if there were more brownies. <laughs> I'm give it a 10. Maybe we're just basic merchants. Obviously, we'd eat again. Oh my god, it looks just like Thai milk tea. It looks fun. <laughs> Look at that orange. Are you so fun? Yeah! Cheers. That's a confusing flavor. Taste, I give it a 10. Like, if you're a fan of Thai milk tea and you don't want those cheap lame, uh, replicas of Thai milk tea. Tato, get get this ice cream for me. Well, I like Thai milk tea, but in ice cream form, you know, it kind of just hit different. <laughs> Punch is different for me personally. It's like seven. It's so strong, honestly. Hit it again. Yes. No. <laughs> I, I I prefer Thai milk tea as itself. <laughs> but it's I dig it. Okay. okay. Pulveron flavor. Look at that. Whoa. <laughs> it, was, it was a lot more melted than I expected. Alright, okay, so I'm gonna try this. My ice cream syllabus. For. I mean, it tastes just like pulveron. I give it a 6. I give it a 5. Why does it taste like burnt popcorn? <laughs> I get the texture. like The texture no. of the bits, you kind of have to chew it a little. Would you eat it again? No? <laughs> yes, I would. <laughs> but yeah, like, I don't know, it's a fun experience in my mouth. Like, pulveron. <laughs> And then there's like these crunchy, chewy bits, and then suddenly it's like popcorn flavored, but it's not, I think. But it's fun. Okay, next is Casa de Bola. Ooh. So that's what it looks like. <laughs> it's just so hard to eat. I'm gonna give it a 7.5 because it tastes like cheese. I like it. It tastes it's like salted caramel, nut, which is weird. Or maybe we just need to cleanse our palate, yeah? <laughs> so for taste, I give it a, an 8. It's like cheese, but it's creamier, you know? I'd eat it again. How about you? No. 
our tastes are so different. Oh my, this is great. Scandalously chocolate. Whoa, that looks so good. Bias so is chocolate. So I might give it a higher score than what it is. So it's Great taste. I give it. I like chocolate. I give it an A. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like velvety chocolate. Does that make sense? Can you? Yeah, it's like a really strong flavor. Uh oh. Would I eat it again? Yes. Mm. I already have two on my list now that I eat again. Let's be basic. French vanilla. Oh my gosh, it's so scary. What if it falls? This tiny black bits don't taste. No, it's like a nice vanilla. Give it a seven. I give it a six. I like it. I eat it again. Yeah. Yeah. Six it's vanilla. Some basic ice cream. Here we have sea salt cam caramel. Look at that. It looks so, so smooth and golden and caramel and delicious. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. It's tasty. Ooh, it's. Butterscotch pecan time! What's pecan? Nuts. Oh my god. Oh. Taste that. Nah. It looks like vanilla. Look at that. It has pink bits in it as well. Those pink bits. They're popping in my mouth. Mmm. It didn't pop in my mouth, but it tastes good. It's so creamy, you know? Yeah. It's the vanilla I really like. <laughs> oh, I give it a 7. I give it a 8. Like, ooh. Would you eat it again? So next is almond lychee. Okay, you know I'm giving it an 8.5 because it's so sweet. I 
give it the 10. <laughs> I like it. Mm. It's good. Mm. Would you eat this it again? This is what I expect some of the time of this. I'm cold. Yeah. So maybe my expectations are just off. It's not the ice cream flavor, it's me. <laughs> no, I like this though. Would I eat it again? I'm already yeah. eating it again. <laughs> Yes, I would. Ako, I mean, yeah, I would. Oh, the crunchy bit. It's good, na. It really reminds me of that dried carrot. Wow. Oh my god. May Malteser siya. Here it is. Where's the Maltesers? I don't want it. I don't want it. Okay. Mm. Taste. You spread the joy. I right? give it an 8. I give it an 8 too. It's pretty good. It's really good. I just wish it was crushed now since it's like we took a bite and there wasn't a mod in there. It's like eh. Just vanilla. It's like eh. But with the mod there, it's like whoa. Would you eat it again? Sure, it's dripping. Mm, dripping. <laughs> Here we have it. Wow. Oh, that looks so creamy. Are you gonna try it? Give it a 10. It tastes like a cappuccino. I like it. It's yeah. like a milky, strong cappuccino. That's the opinion of someone who likes coffee. It's like the opinion of someone who doesn't like coffee that much. It tastes like Starbucks, but not in a fun way. <laughs> I don't like it that much so far. It's fine to eat it again. Yes. No. Our last flavors are pretty Last flavors for this video, for this half, I don't know yet. So there's like, I ordered like 30? 30 ice creams. So it's strawberry and dark chocolate. Strawberry, yeah, it tastes amazing. I look at that. I'm not, I'm, yeah. Dark chocolate, basic, taste. Oh, five. I give it a seven. Dark chocolate. Chocolate! Mm. You have to end with the most basic flavor. This I would give it a 6.5. I'd give it a 6. The scandalously chocolate was better. And we ended it with a shebang. What's your favorite ice cream so far? I think I have a top 2. Black Sesame Oreo and Cookies and brownies. It's hard and basic, no? <laughs> but it's good! Well, let, let me have my top, top three. Well, I think it's just cookies and brownies. I'm so basic. <laughs> I like was the, the creamy vanilla flavors. Huh. Yeah, just my top three. In conclusion, scandalously chocolate as well, obviously. Okay, anyway. So, this is part one of Mary Lou taste test ranking thing with Ian. Yeah. yeah, with your special guest. Yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe. And let us know what flavor you want to try. Thanks for watching. The first comment will get a heart <laughs> from Ia. <laughs> I'll give you one of my parts. Hi, <laughs> It's for you, first comment. It's for you. Okay, so, um, yeah, thanks for watching. See you in the next video, part two with Mary Moo, and yeah. Bye!